Hello guys and welcome back to another video here on the Mania Mission 24-7 channel. In today's video we're going to be showing you how to install Replay Mod using the Multi MC installer. First thing you'll need to do is download Multi MC. To do this go to multimc.org and scroll down on the first page and click the download next to Windows. Once you've downloaded Multi MC you will get a zip folder exactly like this. Right click the zip folder and extract it to the local area. For example I'm going to use 7-zip so 7-zip extract here. That will create the Multi MC instance ready for you to use. What you'll need to do is go ahead and click Multi MC. This will create your Multi MC server setup window. This is how you can have Multi Minecraft client versions available to use at any one time. The first thing you need to do is set up your account by going to settings and going to accounts. When you're in this accounts window you'll then need to go ahead and add. You'll then need to add your Minecraft email address and your Minecraft password into this box and click on OK. Once you've set up your account, you'll then need to create your first instance here in MultiMC. Go up to the top right hand side and click Add Instance. You can then choose the instant version that you wish to use. I'm going to use 1.16.4 as that's the one I usually use. Go ahead and click OK. What you'll then need to do is go over to the right hand side and click Edit Instance. When you've got Edit Instance, this allows you to install Forge and Fabric. For my one, I like to use Fabric. Go ahead and click Install Fabric. Choose the latest version, my one is 0.10.8, but for you it could be anything sooner. Go ahead and click OK. Fabric Loader will now be automatically installed here on the server. If you've done that, you will then need to open up your .minecraft folder, ready for you to install your mod into. To get the replay mod, what you'll need to do is go to replaymod.com and click download now. Once you've clicked download now, you'll be presented with this page. You then need to find your latest version of the version of the client that you're using. I'm using 1.16.4, so go ahead and click download. You then need to copy that replay mod download into your .minecraft mods folder. Once that's done, the replay mod is now installed and you can now use your Minecraft client. Once you've installed your mod, you can then go ahead and close this edit window. Then you're ready to go ahead and click launch. This will download the library files from Mojang. This may take a couple of minutes to install. Once they're ready installed, the Minecraft client will then start up, as if you're using the native Minecraft client. Once your Minecraft client window opens, you'll then be presented with this window. To make sure the replay mod is installed, you should see this button on the home page, which is Replay Viewer. Once you're ready, go ahead and connect to a server or connect to your local game, which you can then do by doing this. For example, play.missioncraft.tk. Once you've logged into the server, as you can see by the left hand side, we have got the big recording icon that says we are now recording. You can also see that you've also got the options in the escape menu, which is pause and stop recording. If you have your own single player Minecraft world, what you need to do is go ahead and click Minecraft folder and move the world save from your original one into the saves folder in this one. Your original single player Minecraft world save will be under this exact file path. See, users, your Windows username, app data, roaming, .minecraft and saves. Copy that same folder into the world saves folder of your multi MC client. 1.16.4 client will then be installed with replay mod installed. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, then please do leave a like and click that subscribe button. Also, if you want to see how to use Replay Mod, there's a video up in the top right hand corner or down in the description down below. Until next time, thank you very much for watching and goodbye.